we have seen a transition from LLM to agent and we'll see why we have seen that. So th this ecosystem design is important for you to understand because uh, uh, this will give you a clear idea on what are the skills you need or if you are building something, this is how you have to start. So if you look at this ecosystem design, as an end user, I'll be interacting mostly with application. So there's an user, user interface or some kind of interface that I will interact with. Like let's say if you have built a chatbot, and if that chatbot you want to integrate into WhatsApp, then I will be integrating with a WhatsApp number, okay, or a bot. So that becomes an application interface. Or let's say you are interacting with ChatGPT, Perplexity, Gemini, Cloud, so on and so forth. It's all user interfaces. So we always start with application as an end user. Now all this application, when when we started, uh, when we saw the rise uh, with ChatGPT and other tools, they, earlier it was all LLM powered applications. Okay, they were using some models like GPT 3.5 or you know uh, gpt4 uh, in the beginning and there were there were some system prompts there were some guardrails and all these applications were using llms but we have seen a transition from llm to agent and we'll see why we have seen that okay so all these application today that we use are mostly agent powered and then all these agents that we see are llm powered right so all these are llm powered agents today when we talk about agent keep that in mind right llm basically work uh, works as a reasoning engine because they can interpret languages they can understand uh, they can generate so all these agent today are llm powered but agent is again not a new concept as like ai so application powered by agents agent powered by llms and agent uses this tool the only the only main reason or the main issue i see with uh, agent is memory one of the most complex topics to kind of uh, do research and anybody who wants to do a venture or something uh, in this field, have a look at that part where you can build better memory systems for agents. So this is an entire ecosystem. Start from application and then goes technically to protocols and memories and evaluations and a lot of other things. 